So these are like my recent grades for obviously marketing. Uh, so I started off pretty good here. And then, you know, introduction, pass, then a credit, then a couple of, you know, failed tries, and then the credit, then high distinction, then one wrong try before I got a distinction, then a pass, then a distinction, then a couple, a few goes and distinction, and then distinction, a few wrong tries, another distinction, distinction again, um, distinction, 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 satisfactory, so it's, uh, credit, <laughs> uh, credit, credit, <laughs> so some things I got and other things I didn't, so not a too bad grading thing, but um, a lot of people have been um, pressuring me to w want to do more like a uni course, um, but I'm not sure if I'm really all that smart, like some things I get, other things I don't, so when I don't get it, I find it quite hard, when I do get it, you know, I find it, I, I do quite well, so, um, so, it's, I'm, I'm pretty by and by, I've always gotten those sorts of grades, nothing's really changed, um, but it does educate you, like, it's worth doing if you care about smarts or education, if you know what you're doing and you don't need either, <laughs> you just need a personality, say, um, or base writing skills, then that's fair enough. I mean, it's lucky that you don't need them, but if you're sort of not really sure about, or you just like to um, give yourself more knowledge about things that you never knew about, then it's worth doing. I've discovered ever since I started learning things, it, it does make you more... Um, intelligent in in the fact that you know more about things that you never knew about you know so um or you develop your knowledge or redevelop your knowledge like you say oh, I studied that in high school ages ago but then you you know you learn it again and it sticks with you a little bit more so all this education stuff I think it is relevant um it's worth doing especially if you don't know very much um, but saying that you know not everyone likes to study um, some people just say oh, I don't have the money and throw it away or I had enough of study at high school and they throw it away and they still you know do quite well but other people um, just don't know what they're doing they lack direction and so they study to learn things um, I sort of do it to improve my knowledge um, I don't really think I have very high career prospects anyway, so a lot of times I don't really care about study because I don't really see myself getting a job anyways, even though I've done such and such a certificate. Um, so I really just do it just to give, feed myself knowledge because I'm not, I'm not naturally very smart, um, and... And I don't know a lot of stuff, you know. Um, and it does give you education. So, um, but I don't, I don't know um, about uni, uni degrees or whatever. But um, if I do do uni degrees, I probably do something that I can relate to a lot easier, um, as opposed to business. I can probably do like. Uh, other things if I can because otherwise you know I got the worst score in the world on my HSC and I am you know only scraping to to enter into one subject if I do uni degree but um as opposed to the subjects that I'd rather do um so my high schooling didn't really prepare me very well for uni because it was sort of a failure you know especially in my last year you know, especially, um, you know, is when I realized I didn't really have 
a solid subject base, um, and I didn't have a clue of what it most like most of my subjects were about. Only some I had done at least one year before, um, and so it was and I ended up like halving my study load because I had did not get along with the teachers. I couldn't understand anything, and you know, um, and I found it quite difficult. Um, I had you know, asked if I could study from home, but my parents were too busy about worrying about the money as opposed to offering me the best education experience to get me through HSC with the best possible results. So they were humming and hiring about money more than anything else and and the social aspect of schooling. I mean, they were more concerned about the people I would meet or, or would not meet as opposed to my how well I will do in an exam. So I didn't sort of get what I wanted and as a result my, my, my score didn't, my HSC didn't really do me much. You know, I did it, you know, and I got a base level score, but I could have done it, I think, a lot better if I had studied from home because I could have worked on, worked on it and taken it at my own pace more and understood more because you're teaching yourself these things and I think I would have understood more generally so um so yeah but um so I have been studying I'm considering maybe uni but I don't I don't know I mean I, I'm not sure if I really need these things I just do them just to give open opportunities not to and to learn not not to actually give myself opportunities. I mean, there's possibilities everywhere, but I'm not really getting it, you know, not really getting in. So, um, a lot of people say, if you're not getting anywhere, just stop studying <laughs> and stop doing stuff. That's, you know, and, you know, and just sit at home and, and, and do stuff, you know. So, um, <laughs> but, um, a lot of people would give up, but I, I sort of just do it. I educate myself. I give myself you know, a little pat on the back whenever I finish things. But it's, I, I don't believe it's going to give me further career development. I just think it gives me understanding about things that I don't generally know about. Um, so, um... But sometimes I pass quite well, other times I don't pass so well. As you can see, those scores... But yeah, I'm sort of getting sick of looking for work, so... I just want to... You know, I don't really want to work anymore. <laughs> and, and I've hardly ever had a job, you know, so... You know, I obviously, I obviously need the money. I just don't want to work, you know. I don't want to go into an office where no one likes you and 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 you just you know put my effort in and then have nothing really, you know. There's no real, you know. Oh, you did well here. I see. You know, it's more like, oh, you worked somewhere for a month. Okay, that's not impressive. Like, <laughs> but no. So um, I don't really get any high rapport. You know, I just get. Like, okay, I did it. Okay, fair enough. You know, it does give you a bit of an income boost, but it's like, it doesn't really make you think, oh, now I can move to another, move on and ha have higher opportunity of getting a job. You just move on and it's like, uh, you just see, it doesn't really improve your opportunities, I don't think. I mean, it, it doesn't really leave you feeling anything. So, <laughs> and you definitely, like, don't, yeah, so I don't really want to work anymore anyways, but I I need, yeah, but, and I, I'm not sure if I want to study or what. I wouldn't mind, like, there are two degrees, uni degrees that I wouldn't mind doing, and there's also one more certificate course I wouldn't mind doing. I've always wanted to do childcare, but I couldn't be bothered with childcare because I'm not very good with kids at all, um. It's not like I can't get along with them. It's just that I don't really feel like I have what it takes to look after kids, really. So, anyway, so I, I couldn't be bothered doing childcare. I just sort of think I couldn't be doing bother doing any of this stuff anymore, <laughs> you know. So I sort of feel like deflated about work and 
but I'm not really sort of feeling like I want to work anymore so even though you know but so I'm trying to base myself more at home but saying that I do look for work still but I'm lost all passion for it like I don't really care about it. I don't really want to go into an office to work either <laughs> you know I don't I don't really want all that stuff you know um but yeah and I don't even know if I want to continue studying like I know I said yeah the courses I've done it are great but you know you know whenever you know you're it Korea I mean what's a career I mean I'm not developing a career especially not in but they are useful I mean if I want to start my own business from home sure enough I've got some some credit but you know it's, you know, when you talk about career you know developments like you know, what's a career you know uh, you know I'm pretty much done with work and uh, I haven't had a career you know and so you know whatever opportunities have just been a waste of time you know and, so, um, yeah, so, but it's good to study. I mean, that's my negative about my career. It's good to study, though, because you learn things. Some people want me to study law, and I'm like, oh, I'm not much of a lawyer. I can get that I could get into it somehow, but I'm not sure if I really want to study it because the courses that I want to do next are ones that I find it easier to do. It's not like discovering something you never know about you've never known about I'd rather just do something that's easy for me to do um you know I could write a book a lot quicker than I can study a you know a business course you know so um so I'd, I'd rather you know do something uh, study in a different area just for personal study you know you may as well if I'm doing a major course I may as well do something that I'm actually half good at you know so but if I just want to do short courses whatever you know I can do whatever you know but yeah